How's it going? How you doing? What's the haps? You tell us. A cup she swimsuit haul. A cup she swimsuit haul. Yes. Today is a huge day in the Marshmallow household. We got a very exciting email in our inbox. marshmallow inbox? Yes. A cup she reached out to us mm -hmm. and was kindly offering to send us bikinis for free. Yay! Oh. It's our first time ever that a brand contacted us. We were so excited. We were like embarrassingly excited. We were like, oh. My fingers were like fire to reply. I was like, who? Oh, yes. 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 Please. If you'd be so kind. We chose yes. three each. And we're gonna make a haul out of that. Yay. So what's interesting and incredible about Cupshe, and we are not just, we have not, there were no conditions. We don't have to say good things, yeah. we have to say bad things obviously. So we're gonna be as honest as we can with you guys. Yeah. And something that I immediately noticed was they have a crazy range of sizes. Like there's the normal section, which can go up to double XL. Yeah, the normal section, thank you. They can go up to double XL, which means that if you're a mid-size, if you could be like maybe one size larger than me and then you can shop there. But they also have a totally separate plus size section, which is really cool. And those those go up to like a 4XL, which is like incredible. Amazing. I mean, tell me about your yes. ordering process. So my ordering process, um, I ordered from the normal section. Um, my and I just fell off. That's My dramatic. tiny chubba chub just fell off. Off my ear. Oh. I'm actually really upset about that. And they asked us to pick three uh, bikinis or one pieces and then four backups. So I had a field day. I really love shopping. I really love picking stuff. And I ended up picking three that I really like, but I ordered all of mine in a medium because mm -hmm. I'm an Australian size 12 and that's what the size chart told me to do. So I follow that like Bible. Girl. Ooh, I was really I'm impressed. Really happy. I was really impressed, Cupshe. When they arrived at our house, they opened the package and they all individually come in this plastic. Now I'm not pro plastic. We're not. I'm not pro individually wrapping plastic things. Yeah. But when you are ordering a product, you are impressed by that's nice. the level of like, quality that yeah. this brand is putting out. Like the attention to detail, mm. each individually packed item. I yeah. just think it was like a nice attention to detail. It was a nice attention to detail. We would recommend Cupshe invest in maybe some recyclable yeah. packaging, but don't ever stop the packaging because it was a really nice touch. It really like made it seem like it was a more luxe experience. Makes me feel like a rich customer. Yeah, even though we are these not bikinis are so affordable, guys. Yeah. We obviously didn't pay, but if we had, they are still within our price range of yeah. being broke. 25 to 35 US dollars. There you go. Cup sheet. Everything. Mad props. We're happy. We're, We're happy. very happy. So, let's get into this try on. What are we doing? Why are we indoors right now? This is a bikini haul. We live in Australia. Let's what the hell are we doing? We're shut ins usually, when so. We got a beach to the right, beach to the left, and we just... Not today. Not today. For you guys, we're gonna go try these bikinis on at the goddamn beach. We're going to the beach. We're going to the beach. Marshmallow girls are beaching it today. Let's get toasted. Beach. Oh wait, my mortal enemy, Sand. Why did you wear sneakers to the beach? I don't come here often. So my first bikini was a cute little polka dot number. So this is my first one from Cupshe. Um, I'm a huge fan of the top. The bottom, I don't know. I'm confused. Because I used to think that high-waisted bottoms were exactly like what I needed to wear, but now I'm not so sure. Like I feel like this is almost too high-waisted. Like normally my bottoms go to like just under my belly button. And this is like a nappy. 
so I feel like it's really like just not on. Do you know what I mean? But I feel cute. But yeah, tell me what you think. I think it's really cute. The pipe nuts are really bad in purple. I don't feel like I'm gonna pop out, which is a huge achievement with my giant bazonkas. And there are cups in there, but you don't need them because this covers any sort of like nip action. But it's nice to have, I guess. Keeps them warm. And yeah. Because I love you, I'm getting in the water. It's the end of winter, which means it's been cold for three months in this country, which means the water's going to be freezing. But I'm doing it for you. So I really want to know if this goes see through because it's a light color. So. <sighs> I was just telling our friends that I won't be going out there. You have to! Every single seat needs to have a wall I don't test. think that's true. I can attest to this one being not see-through. All right, I can't see myself, so it I don't know. It didn't go see-through, it didn't go see-through. It didn't go see-through. No. What do these look like? Are they less fun now that they're something wet? Slightly less fun. Slightly less fun, okay. They don't hold a lot of water, which is good. I feel good. I feel very comfortable. As you can see, I thought the top looked really, really pretty. It did a really good job of modestly covering my boobs which i'm really impressed with because it's really hard anyone that has like big boobs knows how hard it is to not look like like really oh, sexy God, so yeah it's not it. yeah like oh no my yeah. big boobs oh. yeah. like you know it's really hard and people judge you for it and people stink don't listen to what they say anyway it was really nice to wear something cute for once and actually look cute for me i had a little issue with the bottoms i think i'm quite picky about my bottoms i don't know whether it comes from like self-esteem issues with my like lower half or like just like just knowing what looks and doesn't look good. So for me, the nappy style, so the really high waisted ones, aren't my shtick. Okay, let me clarify. There are three types of bikini bottoms to me. There's the normal ones that go up to your hip. There's high waisted that go just below your belly button. And then there's these nappy style ones that are really high waisted, but the butt bit is also really high. Yeah. So it doesn't cover your butt. It's supposed to sit on your butt cheeks. Yeah. And these are those type, which is so cute. And it's a really good design. But personally, for my body type, I didn't love. Yeah, I think it's beautiful. I really like that one on you. I think Thank the you. color and your skin tone is mwah, yeah. mwah, delicioso. Thank you. I think the polka dots are cute. I think the top is glamorous. <laughs> so, the first um, swimwear that I tried on was from my backup list. It is a peachy floral molded cup one piece swimsuit. Hey guys, so this is my first outfit. It's a one piece. It feels very well made. It's like really nice material it's that unusual swimsuit material but it feels thick and the padding and the cupping of the boob area is like high quality I don't have any danger of slipping out which is my number one fear when I go to the beach color wise it is very vibrant and pretty it's very like beach appropriate it's got this cute little strap at the back which I think is a really nice detail um, it's actually something I wouldn't normally go for but now that I have it I love it I don't know I think it's just a really flattering cut and it's very supportive and well made. You look amazing. Thank you. What do you feel about the cups? It's good. Yeah? There's a little room. I think it looks incredible. But like, I feel, I feel fully protected, you know what I mean? Like I feel like there's no danger of me falling out, there's no danger of the girls coming out to play at the beach. But it's very comfortable. I like it a lot. bad guys like I can't even tell you how bad it is I can't believe Millie's doing this to be quite honest man she, you look like Baywatch you look so hot have we gone see through you absolutely have not show me the back the back nope no see through I think the pattern is stunning. I thought it was really nice. It's very you and I love that. It's very nice. I think it's a flattering cut. Oh my god, yeah. It's very flattering. You looked incredible. It has like a little band around the waist that I feel really like tied it all together. Yeah. It was right. The cups, I feel I didn't have the proper supplies to fill the whole cup, to fill said cups, but 
Do you I think so? I think that they molded your titties perfectly. They were giving the impression of old titties, but beneath, if you looked under, like my boob was just like, <laughs> <laughs> like my boob was like, huh? and then the cup was like, oh, like crazy, like, like a, a protective, like a protective armor against my poor little shrivel upset thing. Yeah, you looked yeah. full cup yeah. and ready to go. You don't know what lies beneath, but it was definitely giving support that I needed. Yeah. It wouldn't, you know, come off in the water, which is great. I was like a huge fan of that color on your skin, like Peach. the peachy color. Mm. I used to only wear one pieces. I'm not a bikini girl. Mm. I know you're gonna you're gonna hear that a lot from these cup she holds. Like a lot of people are uncomfortable in bikinis, and yeah. that's totally a okay. The next two are really interesting. What we decided to do was order the same bikini. Aww. So it's very rare that we could even order the same bikini yeah. because we are very different sizes. But we could. Cup she come through. But we all thought it would be really interesting to see what the same bikini looks like on two different body types. Hi guys. <laughs> Welcome to my beach. This bikini is actually my favorite. I love like vintage looking swimsuits like red gingham. Gingham, yeah. I think red gingham is like a perfect swimsuit material. And I have the lazy of pink gingham swimsuit. So I just think it looks really nice and beachy and like vintagey. As you can see, it's like a ruffled top, which I love. I think it's really flattering and keeps it all compact and tight in there. The bottoms are high waisted and very comfortable. They cinch it at the waist as I believe all high waisted swimsuits do. The comfort level is like a 10. This is the most comfortable bikini I've ever worn. Purely because like the ruffles just make it like almost like just a crop top. I would wear this as a crop top and I probably will wear this as a crop top in the future. It's very comfortable. The sizing is perfect. It's a medium and it is not feeling tight or anything. The straps are adjustable. I can't toot the horn of this swimsuit enough. Toot toot. This is a good swimsuit. This is exactly what I want from a bikini. If you're looking for the perfect bikini, Let's take it for a wear test, baby. No, I think people understand that this is like the perfect bikini. I think I've said enough. I don't think people want to see me in the water again. Do you hear that? It's the sound of people calling you a little bitch. All right. <laughs> I'm not going to be called a little bitch. <laughs> Incredibly, there's literally no change to it. It feels like really good. It wow. feels really good. This this bikini could stand the test of time and sand. I think this is a really good bikini. So this is my second bikini, and obviously it's the same as Millie's one. I would maybe wear different bottoms with this next time. I'm not like I'm again. I'm not feeling the nappy bottom. I feel like it doesn't suit my body type. I don't know. If it was like slightly more lower and then this wasn't happening, I think it's really cute. And like Millie said, I would totally wear this as a crop top. You're good. Okay, one more thing guys. I actually noticed with Millie's, the ruffle stays out, but if you have big bitties like mine, for some reason, it, I feel like it keeps tucking in. Like it just kind of disappears. Oh wow. Yeah, nice. so it's really weird, but yeah, again, it's not like a, it's not a terrible thing. It's just something I noticed, but otherwise it's really cute. So we went with this beautiful gingham number. It's red, it's picnic-y. It's, it's red, and when you look on the website, it's red, but when it came, it is red and orange. Yes. So if I zoom in now on the website, yes, you can see the orange kind of, but it's definitely more of a red and orange it's a than mixed just a red. Yeah, yeah. But so it's, it's still so pretty, I was not mad at that. Maybe that's just me not taking the time to look, because it definitely <laughs> looks like that on the website. <laughs> We, I think we both really like this one. Yeah, I was a little uncomfortable again with the nappy sack, but we've already talked about that. Top was stunning. Yeah. You looked I personally love an So episode. good. Oh my god. This style of bikini is like your sh. I think this is me. I think it's this is me. I think I love the ruffled top and I love a nappy bikini. You look so. I think nappy bikinis actually suit pear shaped girls really well. Yeah, they tighten my little. It just. I really liked it and I felt comfortable in it. And it's very vintage looking. You know, when I look for a bikini, yeah. that's what I want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We are not beach babes. I don't know if you ever noticed, but I glow. So. For us to do a bikini haul, it was kind of like, oh, it's out of our comfort zone. do we want to? Not really. And then we like, we were like, let's just look what's online. And we were like, oh my God, this stuff is actually really, really yeah. cute. Like it's really different. Neither me or Millie are going to rock like the, 
the Instagram. Oh my god, like the ones that sit like up on the high. Oh my god, it's not for me. It's you can rock me. that, girl. I you look good. good. You look we so good. are not comfortable. We're in not it, bad. That's okay. That's so totally fun. <laughs> but yeah, so that's why we're really happy. Like, cause she really appreciates uh, a non-beach beach person. <laughs> yes, my last one was my favorite one. Mm -hmm. I really liked it. You're a fruity gal, so I can see why. Hi guys, so this is my last one. It. I lied to you before. I'm so sorry, but I lied to you. The gingham one was not my favorite. This one is my favorite. And I knew when I saw it on the website that I loved it. So the thing that I really like about this top is that it's pleptum and it also has the raunch. Peplum? Pleptum? Peplum? Pleplum? Peplum? 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 What is it? Is it peplum? Peplum. So the thing that I really like about this top is that it's peplum and it has this little like, ooh, moment. So uh, all of my shady bits are covered, which is nice. It's very you have awesome. no shady bits. There are some shady bits. And the ruffled top, as I said before, is like my favorite feature. I don't know why. It just avoids any nipple issues. It just keeps everything tight and kind of like, I have no fear of popping out. Not that there's much to pop, but if there was a pop, I would not be happy. So this bikini top is like my dream. It's got everything I need. It feels really sturdy. The straps are really comfortable. The material is so, it feels expensive guys. And these are affordable bikinis. I know we got something for free, but these are affordable bikinis. In my day, we were rocking $70 billabongs. So yeah, the bottoms are just kind of like plain, a really nice green, a really nice mossy green. The sizing, as always, perfect. I'm someone that used to buy really big bikinis and really big swimsuits, but like it was a size 16. So just measure yourself, guys. Measure yourselves. <laughs> yeah, this is my favorite one. Candy stripe blue and neon yellow lemons. I love a fruity bikini. I love it. guys I'd like to apologize formally to the audience and to Cupshi but it's really cold so I shall be doing a wear test for this one I think it'll be okay I think it'll be okay I want to give the Millie seal of approval that I think it'll be okay I don't think there'll be any cups showing I'm just too scared to go in the water it's like minus 10 degrees y'all the waves are loud guys I promise you I swear on this cup she bikini that I don't think this would turn see-through in the water. I'm so sorry that I've disappointed my fans and cup she. The peplum. Peplum. How did I, I was staring at it. The peplum mm. was really nice mm -hmm. and I love fruit and I love like fruity, Summer, springy vibes. Yeah. I just think fruit and the beach go together like <laughs> Especially lemon. Especially lemons. I think the bottoms were the nicest shade of green. Like I love oh, green. Yeah. It's oh. like this green. It was like a beautiful planty like green. green. So yeah, that last one was my favorite one just because of the colours and the fit and the style. No, it suited you like a I liked it a lot. God damn, you look like a freaking angel. I liked it a lot. And your last one. <laughs> Damn messy Guys, up. We gotta talk about this. Damn messy We gotta talk about this. My last one I ordered on a like, I was just like, I have to get it because it is a reversible bikini. <gasps> what the heck? Excuse me? Yeah, reversible bikini. So that means four in one, baby. Four in one. Hey guys, so this is my last bikini and it is reversible. I'm just letting that sink in because that is so cool. It was the only one I saw on Kopshi and I was like, I need to try it. Even though normally a bikini line bottom isn't like what I go for because I need this to be all like held in. And this kind of is like, it's actually doing a great job. So I'm, I feel like everything I knew about bikinis is gone. So I'm going to quickly show you like the two little reverse sides of this. So this is reverse number one. Okay guys, so this is number two. As you can see, like the bottoms and the tops reverse and I thought, in my mind, I was like, oh, there's only two bikinis, that's so cool. And then Millie was like, there's four. So this is like an endless bikini train and I am on board to, to let me show you the other two versions. Okay, so this is the floral side, which I'm really, really happy with. The drawstrings are like everything to me. I love them. You can loop them loose so you can tie them up, but I like just the little detail of it, like daintily hanging down the side of my body. But yeah, cute. And the last one, Last one! I like this one as well also because it obviously matches my hair right now so I feel like a little anime character which is really cute!
it. Oh, the one thing you have to be careful with this one is that the cups move around a lot, but that's okay because you can just, it's really easy to just move them. Like you can just pick them up and pump them where you want. <laughs> I love this one. Is this bikini see through? No. No. What can you see? Why are you hesitant? I can. Yes, okay, yep. So you can see the cups. Oh, there we go. You can see the cup. It's see like not cup. ideal. Very clearly. Yeah. This is the bane of my existence. Very like Madonna gun titties, you know what I mean? Like, oh wow, okay. okay. So my favorite bikini, the cup show, on this side, do they show on the leafy side? All right guys, so Tiasha is trying out the leafy side of the bikini. All right, let's have a look. Judge me. How are we looking? You're fine. You Have can't see. This? You can't see the cup. You can't see the cup. No, guys. you can't see the cup so, on the lazy side. I reckon when you're dry, frolic around on the pink side, and then when you're about to get wet, pop it over. Twenty-four fifty for four bikinis. Four bikinis. Twenty-four fifty. Twenty-four fifty for four, four bikinis. bikinis. Actually, surprisingly, that cut looked really good it did i the wasn't expecting one the was lower beautiful. one i was really worried about it but it looked amazing it looked really good so i'm really happy with it guys out of all the ones i think i bought i think that one is my favorite like it's so pretty and i would wear the bikini as a top yeah like, i would if for all of them actually yeah. i would wear the bikini is that something she does on peppers like are they supposed they're to be very wearable reused? they're so wearable in day-to-day -day yeah. life they're very flattering. Ugh. Something I noticed as I was hanging that dry this afternoon mm. was that there is a little hole on the inside where you can pull the padding out. So <gasps> if your padding goes transparent and that's an issue for you and you have no qualms about showing your nips, do it. That's Take huge. the padding out. That's huge. Because I'd rather have nips on show than a weird like circle. Final thoughts? Final thoughts, really impressed with Cup Sheet. Um, I would actually recommend it if you're looking for a new bathing suit this summer and you don't have like 70 to $150 yeah. to spend on a new swimming costume. Yeah. Um, things I would change, the cups. The cups I would put a little bit more effort into. Yes. I wouldn't mind a bit more variety in the plus size section. There's some pretty ones. Yeah. There's definitely some ones that I would order, but I would love the, the amount of swimming costumes in the regular size yeah. compared to the plus size is a bit like one There's and a half lot to two less. pages. Yeah. There's a lot less. So I wouldn't mind if cups you put a bit more time into yeah. making that size bigger or have all the bikinis available up to 4XL. Like, it, yeah. why stop at 2XL? Agreed. Just do all of them. Mm. I don't really have a qualm to say. Mm. Yeah, you did good. I did good. I did good. Let us know which one is your favorite bikini. Also, I'm specifically interested in which version of my reverse look bikini you guys like yes. the best. Guys, and we have some links. Yes. In our description. Yes. If you want to buy any of the bikinis or one pieces that we wore today, there are some links in our description box down below. Head there. If you saw them and you were like, yes, that's what I've been waiting for my entire life. I, I hope you thought that because Really we nice. looked good. We looked good, guys. So Cupshi has also given us a discount code. So thanks, Cupshi. At checkout, put in the code YT Marshmallow. We've put it here. So yeah, if you check that in, you get 10% off, which is really cool. Pretty it good. may not seem like a lot, but every bit counts when you're as poor as we are. So yeah. we will take that 10% discount code <laughs> and, and go straight to the bank. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> but other than that, don't forget to follow us on Instagram. Marshmallow Gals, G A L S, and to subscribe to this YouTube channel and turn on the notifications if you have not already. Peace! And with that, keep it cute and keep it sweet. Mwah! You guys are really awesome. At 24 minutes. Did we just want for 24 minutes? Toy. Ah. Mama got some editing to do. Toy.